Now the today is same topic, Beach Stone Bridge. So previous day, the example, first method has completed. Now the for the same example, second method. Example is this is Beach Stone Bridge. It is unbalanced. It is five ohm, it's ten ohm. This one is ten ohm, and this is five ohm. This resistance is five ohm. We find the equivalent resistance between A and the C. This one is C. This one is B. This one is B. Connect A C to a battery of E M F E. When we switch on the circuit, current starts from this point I. At point A, it is divided into two parts. Suppose for 5 ohm, current is I1, and for 10 ohm, it will be I minus I. Same current will flow through this 5 ohm, that's I1. Through 10 ohm, it will be I minus I1. Now, to find the current through BD, so this is I dash. To find the value of I dash at junction, we apply KCL. Incoming current that I1 will be positive, I dash will be negative, and I minus I1 will be again negative. I minus I1 plus minus I plus I1. That which you I dash will be 2i1 minus i. That means through this 5 ohm resistance, 2i1 minus i current will flow. The value of i dash. Now we want to find the value of r equivalent between a and c. There are two unknown values of current i, so there will be two equations. First one is in closed circuit. Closed loop A B B A B B and that's minus five I one minus five two I one minus I plus ten I minus I one that will be zero on solving it minus five I one minus ten I one plus 5i plus 10i minus 10i1 that will be 0 so on solving it 3i minus 5i1 that will be 0 it's number first for second equation it must be with battery b so so this point is m this point is m so in closed loop closed loop a, B, C, M, N, and A. To write the equation, the same order minus 5I1 minus 10 I minus I1 plus E that will be 0 minus 5I1 minus 10 I plus 10 I1 plus E is equal to 0 minus 10 I plus 5 I1 plus e that will be 0 on simplifying this one 2 i minus i1 that will be e by y this one is second now from first and second equation 1 and 2 equation 1 is 3 i minus 5 i1 is equal to 0 and from on multiplying by 5 that's 10 i minus 5 i1 that will be e on subtracting it becomes negative it is positive it is negative it is 0 means minus 7 i that is minus e r ac then equivalent circuit will be it is rac it is connected to a battery having emf e plus minus that is e total current is i so r equivalent will be e upon i is number fourth from one and two one and two r ac 
that's r equivalent that will be e upon i plus 7 over the answer now for third method first of all we will study conversion of star to delta delta to star conversion of star to delta and delta to what is conversion of star to delta this one is star star at this point o this resistance is r1 this one is r2 this one is r3 so this point is 1 this point is 2 and this point is 3 we can convert this one into delta this point is 1 this point is 2 this point is 3 so this resistance will be r13 this r12 is r23 value of r1 will be r12 will be r1 plus r2 plus r1 r2 divided by r3 same by symmetry r13 will be r1 plus r Three plus R one, R three, Y R two, and R two three. That will be R two plus R three, R two, R three, Y R one. These are the important equations. We can solve this one easily, but there is no need. Now conversion of delta to star. This one is delta. We have three resistances. This point is 1, this point is 2, this point is 3. This resistance is R12, this is R13, this will be R23. We can easily convert this one into this star. This star. This point is 1, this point is 2, and this one. This resistance will be R1, it will be R2, it will be R. The value of R1, that will be. R12 R13 divided by R12 plus R13 plus R23. Now, same similarly, R2 will be R12 R32 upon R12 plus R13 plus R. And R13 into R23 divided by R12 plus R13 plus R23. Now, the third method of previous example. Previous example is. This one is 5 ohm, this 10 ohm, this one is 10 ohm, this one is 5 ohm, it's also 5 ohm. Point is A, B, C, and D. Now, this is the example based on conversion of star to delta. Here, star is at point B is at point B and D convert any one star convert any one star to delta so this point is 1 this one is 2 and this point is 3 now here R1 will be 5 ohm, R2 is 10 ohm and R3 is 5 ohm. To find the value of R12, R12 that's R1 plus R2 
plus R1 R2 divided by R3 that will be 5 plus 10 plus 5 into 10 upon 5 that's 25 ohm. Now for R13 that will be R1 plus R3 plus R1 R3 by R2 so it will be 5 plus 5 plus 5 into 5 upon 10 that's 25 by 2 ohm. Now for R23 that will be R2 plus R3 plus R2 R3 divided by R1 will be 10 plus 5 plus 10 into 5 upon 5 that's 25. So new circuit will be this is R12 that's 25 ohm that is 10 ohm is 5 ohm it will be R13 this point is 1 this point is 2 this point is 3 it is R13 and this one is all the values are given here R13 and tan ohm are in pattern so equivalent resistance will be will be 25 by 2 into 10 upon 25 by 2 plus 10 that's 50 by 9 ohm now R23 and 5 ohm are in parallel so equivalent resistance will be equivalent resistance will be 25 into 5 upon 25 plus 5 plus 25 by 6 ohm equivalent circuit for this one it is 25 ohm this one is 50 by 9 ohm this one is 25 by 6 ohm this point is A this point is C so this point is D again 25 by 9 ohm and 26, 25 by 6 ohm they are connected in series so the equivalent circuit will be this 25 ohm this point is A this point is C and it will be 175 by 18 175 by 18 ohm now to find the value of RAC R a C that will be 25 into 175 by 18 upon 25 plus 175 by 18 that's 25 into 175 divided by 175 plus 450 that is 25 into 175 divided by 625 on solving it RAC will be 7 ohm the required answer now the next example next example based on the same method that is 1 ohm 3 ohm is 1 ohm this 3 ohm and is 1 ohm this point is A, this point is B, point R A B. Equivalent resistance between A and B. 
this point is suppose x, this point is y, and this point is z. Consider this term. The star x, y, and z. So our x, y will be. 1 plus 3 plus 1 into 3 by 1 that's 7 or yz will be 1 plus 1 plus 1 into 1 by 3 that's 7 by 3 1 and or zy or z by x z that will be 1 plus 3 plus 1 into 3 by 1 that's 7. Now equivalent circuit will be 7 ohm this point is x this point is y this point is a Point is B. This is 7 by 3 ohm. This is 3 ohm. This is 7 ohm. And uh, this one is 1 ohm. When solving R AB, that will be 5 by 3 ohm. Oh, note. It's important. For the circuit below, Memorize the following formula. Circuit is this one is R O. This is M R O. This one is R O. It is N R O. That is R O. We have to find the equivalent resistance between A and B. This current enters at point A and leave it at point B. Then R A B will be 3 N plus 1 divided by N plus 3 into R. Now, next example based on now. The next example based on conversion of delta to star. Example based on conversion of star to delta. Delta to star. Now example is. This point is A, this point is B. Each resistance of the network is smaller. Find equivalent resistance between A and B. A and B. We have to find R, R, A, B. So this point is 1. This point is 2 and this point is a small r, a small r, this is small r, small r. All the rest is the same. Consider the delta. Connection will be 1, 2 and 3. So r1 will be R into R upon R plus R plus R x R y 3 R 2 will be same R y 3 but R 3 same R 3 will be R y 3 Now the equivalent circuit will be equivalent circuit is it is R 1 also 
our own this point is 3 this one is our own that is r 3 this one is r 1 this one is r 2 this point is a and this point is three. r 1 and r 1 they are connected in series same thing R2 and this R1 they are connected in series so again the equivalent circuit will be it is 4y3 ohm is again 4y3 ohm this resistance is Ry3 R1 and is also R2 we have to find the equivalent resistance between a and B. This point is A, this point is B. It is balanced with this point. Suppose this point is C and D. No current will flow through C D. Means R by 3 resistance. It means we can neglect R by 3. So the equivalent circuit will be this 4 R by 3. This 4 R by 3. That is R1 and is also R1. This one is point A, this one is point B. Now it is clear 4 R by 3 and 4 R by 3 and they are connected in series and R O R O connected in parallel. So we can solve easily or A B will be R A B plus 8 R by 7. Now next question. Unbalanced which is O base. Conversion of star to delta. With the help of this method, we can solve any weak stone bridge. For example, this is the example. This 2 ohm, it is 3 ohm, it is 6 ohm, and it is 7 ohm. This resistance is 4 ohm. This point is A, this one is B, this one is C, and this one is D. We have to find the equivalent resistance between A and C. Find R, A, C. It is different type question. There is more less than small R and capital R and capital R is small R. It is unbalanced. So, we will solve this one with the help of conversion of star to delta. Now, consider star at point B. This point is 1, this point is 2, this point is 3. So, the value of R1 will be Ohm, R2 is 3 ohm and R3 is 4 ohm. So, find the value of R12. R12 will be R1 plus R2 plus R1, R2 divided by R3 plus 2 plus 3 plus 2 into 3 by that's 13 by 2 o. Now similarly R13 will be R1 plus R2 R3 plus R1 R2 R1 R3 by R2 that is 2 plus 4 plus 2 into 4 by 3 that's 26 by 3 ohm. Now for R23, that will be R2 plus R3 plus R2 R3 by R1 is 3 plus 4 plus 3 into 4 
equal to that's 10 ohm. Now the equivalent circuit will be is R12 is 13 by 2 ohm. is 6 ohm this one is 6 ohm 4 ohm so this one is 6 ohm this 6 ohm this is R 1 3 this R 2 3 this point is 1 this point is 2 and this point is 3 now R13 and 6 ohm they are connected in R13 and 6 ohm are in parallel. So equivalent resistance will will be 26Y3 into 6 divided by 26y3 plus 6 that's 39 by 11. Now R23 and 6 ohm are again connected in parallel. So equivalent resistance of equivalent resistance R23 and 6 ohm is 10 into 6 divided by 10 plus 6 that will be 15 by 4 ohm. Now the circuit will be that is 13 by 2 ohm this 39 by 11 ohm and this one is 15 by 4 ohm. This point is A and this point is B. Now 39 by 11 and 15 15 by 4 ohm they are connected in series. So equivalent resistance of, of 39 by 11 ohm and 15 by 4 ohm is 39 by 11 plus 15 by 4 that is 3, 3, 1 divided by 44 ohm. Again equivalent circuit will be this point is A and this point is B. This is 13 by 2 ohm and this resistance is 3, 3, 1 by 44 ohm. Now 13 by 2 ohm and 3, 3, 1 by 44 ohm are in so equivalent resistance are AB that will be 13 by 2 into 3 3 1 by 44 divided by 13 by 2 plus 3 3 1 by 44 plus 13 into 3 3 1 divided by 572 plus 662 plus 4330 divided by 1, 2, 3, 4, 4 is the required answer. It is the answer. Now, next one, the topic will be conversion of galvanometer into ammeter and 